Janine and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I hope that you'll stick around for more of my videos and subscribe. The button to subscribe is right here. You can actually click on it on your computer. And if you want to subscribe on your phone, the little button is right down below that says subscribe. And I upload every Saturday and I hope you'll stick around for more of my videos. Today I'm going to be doing 10 life hacks that you guys need to know. These are things I thought of, things I found. I really tried to make these as original and creative as possible. So I really do apologize if you've seen any of these before. But I feel like these aren't really well-known ones. We'll see. And if you guys didn't know, I have two vlog channels. One is with my boyfriend Jacob and one is my personal one called Janine TV. The one I have with my boyfriend is where we upload a couple vlogs and you guys can just follow us around and see what we're doing. You can click on it right here to subscribe to that channel. And if you want to subscribe to my own personal vlog channel, I do makeup, cheerleading videos, all sorts of little things on there. And you can click on it right here as well to subscribe. And I hope you guys will subscribe to those channels and you can just get to see more of what I'm up to. But I hope you guys enjoy this video and let's just get right into it. The first life hack is to use a bottle cap to hold up your phone. So if you're ever sitting there and you want your phone to be like propped up so you can watch a video, this is an easy trick that you can just cut the sides with a, an X-Acto knife and you can place your phone right there and it'll stay right up. Too, is do you ever have that word on your phone that when you're texting it constantly changes to something else that you didn't want for example for me every time I try and type the word vlog v-l-o-g it changes it automatically to blog what you can do is go to the text replacement thing underneath keyboard and you just insert what word you want that word to change it to for example I'll put blog and make it automatically change it to vlog this will save you so much time and all the hassle of it constantly changing it and having to delete it and rewrite it and this is such a useful life hack for me. Life hack number three is to make sure that you're cutting open your bottles or some sort of tube before you throw it away because there's actually so much extra product on the rim of the bottle that you could be losing and throwing away potentially if you don't cut it open. I do this all the time and especially with like hair products or like squeeze tubes that you don't think you can get anything else out of. You just cut it open, swipe your finger in there, or use some sort of spatula to get the product out, and you're saving so much money, and you're actually getting the full use of the product, so you're not just throwing away extra product that you could have been using. So make sure you always do this before you throw away any product. Life hack number four is, you know whenever you're trying to put on a bracelet that's kind of tight, and you keep trying to like use your one hand to do it and it just won't freaking work. So what you can do is use a paper clip, you can strap it within the hook, you can hold your finger right here with the paper clip and then you can wrap your bracelet around without any problems. It's super helpful and all you really need is just a bracelet and a paper clip. The next life hack is, are you ever worried that someone's going to like break into your phone or they're going to somehow figure out the password or they're going to see what your password is? What you can do is use an accent letter in your password so that nobody will know because nobody's just going to automatically guess that you have an accent in your password and it's just going to be really, really hard to figure out. So if you really have something you want to hide or you just really don't want people breaking into your phone, definitely use an accent on your password. That is if you have an iPhone. That is the sure way to make sure people don't get into your phone. If you ever have a shirt that is super wrinkly and you have somewhere to go really quickly or maybe you don't own an iron, what you can do is just throw it in your shirt or whatever item it is with an ice cube in the dryer for a couple minutes and instantly, boom, the wrinkles will be gone. Life hack. Ultimate life hack. Do you ever have those pants that the zipper just won't stay up and it's just so frustrating because you keep pulling it up, you're constantly like in public and you're like, oh my gosh, is my fly down? I don't know, it's just really awkward. What you can do is use a key ring, loop it in your zipper, and then hook it onto the button to make sure that your zipper no longer slides down. Now this is the legit best life hack that I've heard of because it's so helpful. If you're one of those people who likes to have your phone without a case, I mean, God bless you if you can, that is so risky for me. But whenever you place it on the table, you're like scared it's gonna scratch. All you have to do is just put a rubber band down and then place your phone on that rubber band and it won't scratch anymore when you're putting it on the table. It's such a simple life hack, but it works. 
if you're ever trying to find a clip for your chips bag but you don't have one but you somehow have this laying around, all you can do is just break this off and you can use this as a clip for your chip bag and it works just as well and if not maybe even better and it's just super convenient because you probably already have this in your closet. This last life hack I discovered at school and it was so incredibly helpful so if you're ever wearing like matte lipstick like I'm wearing right now like ColourPop or the Kylie lip kit or whatever some sort of matte lipstick and for some reason you don't have it with you and it starts to flake off it starts to wear off and you're just like I just want this off but if you know anything about the matte lipstick they're extremely hard to take off so I discovered that what you can do in public is if you have chapstick all you have to do is apply the chapstick onto your lip and then just get a wet piece of paper and just wipe it off and it'll come right off. Otherwise, it's super hard to get off. You're literally scrubbing and making your lips super red and irritated. This legit works. I know for a fact. I use it at school and I was amazed. Another benefit of this, it also moisturizes your lips in the process. So instead of them just feeling super dry after you rub everything off, your lips are actually still moisturized. So this is a big, big plus for me. And those are all the life hacks. Let me know in the comments down below what was your favorite life hack out of all of these and which one did you find the most helpful. And of course, don't forget to check out my social media. You can find me on Instagram, Twitter, Tumblr, Snapchat, Facebook. Everything is Janina Mopola. If you guys want to stalk me, we can be friends. Definitely check those out and I interact with you guys on there a lot. So definitely go check out my social media. And once again, subscribe if you're new here. I upload every Saturday and I will definitely be seeing you guys next Saturday. So thank you so much for watching this video. I'll see you guys very soon. Peace out, Girl Scout. Bye, guys.